this is a red wine UI. We have the inputs here and we have the model which is at the back end. Now let's suppose we want to predict the wine quality. With these figures the predicted wine quality is 5.19. So let's suppose we make it to 11 and let's try what it is. So it is 5.19 again. So, so let's suppose we make it 10 here, uh, 11 here, alcohol. So you see it is changing to 5.38. Let's make it to 8. So enough of playing around, so how did I do it? So I use Streamlit, the fastest way to build and share data apps. How do we do it? We have to do a very simple thing. We have to do a pip install Streamlit. And then how do I run it? I run it by using this, Streamlit run redwine.py. So what is redwine.py? Let's see what it is. So here's my redwine.py. And... Uh, First what we do is to, we do a import of the streamlet. This is the title which you are seeing the red wine prediction system. And then we have divided into three columns. And these are the inputs. Text input is there. Then there is the column, the feature sum. The button is here. And then we put it into a list. And then we make it as a data frame. Now this is the most important thing. We have saved the preprocessor as well as the model in our previous model building exercise. Now we used that preprocessor and the model and we have saved it here. You see model.h5 and the preprocessor.p. So these are the two things. We, we load it and then we are predicting it. So predict and we are doing a transform and then we are predicting it. So that's it. This is how we are building it. Hope you had liked. Thank you. Bye.